through video of 3411 Monica Parkway. We are located in Kensington Park, which is north of 17th Street, um, just east of Lockwood Ridge. So it's, it's an okay neighborhood. This is a corner lot. It's a cute pool home. Um, has a metal roof, which I like. It's got three parking spaces. This covered parking actually is, is quite nice. The windows are in really good condition and the tile is nice throughout. I'm so happy to see the same tile throughout a whole house as opposed to the piecemeal that I usually see. It's got exposed beams in cathedral type ceiling. Big open floor plan here. Um, the kitchen is kind of wrap around here. It's kind of a bar. I mean, it's, it's, it's decent. It looks out onto the pool and it has a real nice pool. I gotta say, that's a really nice pool. I think it's eight feet deep. So I think at one point this probably was all garage because I'm stepping down and that series of rooms here, which is kind of weird. Um, you know, you have this room here, which is all, I don't know, it could be a den, an office or something, no closet. Then you have this room, which is like an, a second room. You could have made that one big room. I don't see why not. And then this is the dining room. And so it's kind of an open floor plan. Then back here we have three bedrooms and two baths. And it was a scavenger hunt to find the other bathroom. Again, we got the exposed beams in all the bedrooms and all the ceilings. The house has been repiped, so it has, um, you know, you can see the, the, the pipe that has re replumbed the house, so there's no copper lines going through the slab. Just to take a little peek in here, the air conditioning unit looks old. I, I'm not gonna say how old, but I'm gonna say it's old. Got a little linen closet here, you can see more piping. There's also the attic access there. Just little, more little closets. Okay, so that was bedroom number one. This is bedroom number two. Both these bedrooms look out onto the pool. And again, I really like this pool. Nice pool, but it has a low cage. I like how they did the threshold um, for the tile. So this is the only full bathroom in the house. And it has a tub and a matching sink. It's okay. In this room, this bedroom, and this is where I really had to struggle to find the smallest bathroom in the world. It's in the closet. And so here's a closet. And there's a bathroom. And that is the small sink I've ever seen. It's awfully cute though. And um, so I just got one little toilet here. Oh, I was wondering where that light was coming from. There's a skylight there. That's kind of cool. Hmm. So that's access to the uh, back of the tub. So this is a pretty kind of cool house. Uh, it's got a pool. It's, it's large. Uh, I'm going to go out to the pool here. The kitchen is just okay. You know, that's a Formica butcher block imitation countertop. This is the laundry room. It's got kind of a mud room, laundry room. The panel has room left in it. Water heater looks brand new, so that's good. A little loft storage up there, which is kind of nice. You can see how more of the repiping. Uh, and then I'm um, stepping out to the pool area. Gotta say, this really nice pool. It's in very good condition. I, I really like that. That's, that's cool, and it's solid too. That's, that's awesome. I, kinda, I really like that, the grab bar. Cage is in good condition. Not much to, not much in the way of grass here, I gotta say. Um, you got some pavers out here. You got, you know, for for a corner lot, this is a big lot because, uh, you know, you got. Oh, that's cool too. I didn't even see that. I didn't notice that at first. I love that. It's really cool. Uh, I think this is an eight-foot pool. So, pool equipment's out here. Let's say the air conditioner is old, probably still working, but it's uh, it's old. It's got a shed out here. That's not bad. <clears throat> Yard is fenced, chain link. I'd like more of a privacy fence, but all in all, not bad. So I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, 
Thanks for watching.